For today's video, we're going to be going over how to add an ARC amount to one of your bags. First, you're going to need your bag, your ARC amount, a bracket that you're going to put on the inside of the bag so that the bolts don't pull through, your bolts to mount the bracket to the bag, and a sewing awl. You're also going to need a lighter, a razor, and a leather hole punch. Those aren't necessary, but they make it a lot easier. First thing you're going to do is you're going to cut the stitching to the bag so that you can dump out all of the filling. Next, we're just going to dump the filling into a container so that it's easier to add back later. All right. Next, we're going to mark where we need to punch the holes for the bracket to go on the inside of the bag. This will make it so that the bolts will come through easily and cleanly. You're going to want to make sure that it's lined up with the bag so that it's straight. That way your bag's not canted off to one side or the other when you have it mounted on the arca rail. Next, we're going to punch our holes. That we have, we, we have a nice clean hole that isn't going to fray off. Uh, I ended up having to grab a piece of cardboard to put on the bottom side because the hole punch wasn't going through the fabric. It was just compressing it. So once I had a piece of cardboard, I was able to punch those nice clean holes uh, for both bolts. All right, now that I've got both holes cleanly punched, we're going to grab our lighter. And we're just going to uh, melt the ends so that it doesn't fray any later. I'm going to do this on both the outside of the bag and the inside of the bag just to make sure it stays uh, in the condition that we have it right now. You're just going to give it a quick flash. You don't want to hold the flame there too long, otherwise you'll start to melt the fabric. All right. So that's what the bracket's going to look like on the inside of the bag. Uh, I've turned the bag back the correct way out so that I can mount the Arca rail on the outside. And now we're just going to screw the bolts directly into the Arca rail since it has threading already in it. Next, you're just going to tighten down those bolts to make sure that they don't come loose. You can use Loctite if you want to. I didn't have any with me when I was doing this video, so I didn't use any Loctite, uh, but there's nothing that says you can't use it. All right, now we've got our bracket mounted to the uh, Arca attachment. We're going to put our filling back into the bag. So I just used a measuring cup. It was the easiest way not to make a mess. This also kind of allowed me to pick and choose how much I wanted to put back in. Uh, I did end up not putting 100% of the filling back in just because with the bracket added in there, it was going to fill it too much. Next, we're going to stitch it up with our sewing awl so that we've got a nice stitch. Hopefully yours doesn't break like mine did halfway through. I had to switch out for a different type of needle uh, to get it fixed and finish out the stitch. All right, now it's all stitched up. My bracket's attached. Nice solid attachment. It's not going to go anywhere. Uh, it's going to now allow me to use this bag directly attached to my Arca rail, making my life a lot easier on stages.